around the world, wide body aircraft are typically used for long haul flights. However, this is not always the case, while not often used for long haul flights, narrow body aircraft can travel quite a distance these days. Did you know the flagship carrier of Air Baltic flies the Airbus A220 all the way from Riga to Abu Dhabi, a route of almost 2,359 nautical miles? It is a 5 hour and 50 minute long journey. Heading slightly further afield is British Airways Baby Bus, aka the A318. British Airways has one of the shortest members of the Airbus A320 family which it uses for one specific purpose. The flight, nicknamed BA001, serviced between London City and New York's JFK Airport. While heading to New York, the service stops in Shannon, but the return leg is direct. The Airbus A318 flight clocks in at an impressive 7 hours and 20 minutes, covering a distance of 3,017 nautical miles. Not not bad for the aircraft they literally nicknamed the Airbus Baby Bus. The longest flight on any Airbus A320 family aircraft is made by the Airbus A320 Neo, A321 Neo. The flight between Manila and Sydney operated by a Philippine Airlines is an impressive 8 hours and 45 minutes clocking in at a slightly longer than BA's transatlantic trek. The flight covers 3,371 nautical miles. As you can imagine, being a turbocorp aircraft, the ATRs can go as far as Airbuses. In fact, the longest ATR flight is operated by Air Tahiti. This sees an ATR aircraft operate an 894 nautical mile route between Totegigi and Papete in just 3 hours and 45 minutes. The longest Boeing 737 route flown by the time was Pete, between Pew and Bushgrad. This was with Lutanda's wet leased Pew service operated by Privet Air. However, since the carrier filed for, filed for bankruptcy, it ceased operations. This saw services to this service saw 2,852 nautical miles covered in 7 hours and 40 minutes, which I find is pretty a pretty long time for a 737 to travel that short of a distance. The longest Boeing 737 route by distance sees Copper Airlines flying their 737-800 between Mota Devio and Panama City. This route is currently 2,941 nautical miles and it takes 7 hours and 25 minutes. The longest of all Boeing 747 flights to date around the globe was flown by the MAX 8 before it was grounded in the wake of, an Eth of the Ethiopian Airlines accident. The epic flight saw 3,300 nautical miles covered by Gaul Transportes Aeros the flight time was a staggering 9 hours and 50 minutes in a single aisle-based aircraft. United Airlines operates the world's longest flight with the Embraer E-175. This aircraft travels a distance of 1,539 nautical miles, trekked between Madison and Wisconsin and San Francisco covered in just 5 hours. However, Air Canada takes the biscuit when it comes to the world's longest Embraer E-Series jet time by flight. The Canadian flag carrier covers 1,822 nautical mile flight between Toronto and Portland in 5 hours and 8 minutes. However, Widero has the longest flight by distance using the Embraer E-190-E2 variant. While only clocking in at 4 hours and 23 minutes, the flight covers a greater distance of 60 nautical miles, 1,882 nautical miles flying between Bergen and Lachner. Did you have any idea that narrow single or narrow body jets could have flown such a great distance? 
let me know in the comments down below